A 27-year-old patient has an aneurysm of the aortic arch. This is most likely to compress which of the following structures? Here we have to remember the relations of the aortic arch. Look at this diagram and let's relate it to the options. Option A, right vagus nerve. So it is clear that the right vagus nerve is on the right side and is not related to the aortic arch which is on the left side. Left phrenic nerve crosses the arch of the aorta but in cases of aneurysm of the aortic arch it is less likely to be compressed. It might be pushed but not compressed because it is related to the anterior or left surface of the arch of the aorta. The right sympathetic trunk is located in the posterior part of the mediastinum and it is much far away from the arch of the aorta. Even if the left sympathetic trunk was mentioned, it is much away from the arch of the aorta and is less likely to be compressed by the arch of the aorta. The other option D, left recurrent laryngeal nerve, this would be the correct option because the vagus nerve, as you can see here, the left vagus nerve, as it reaches the ligamentum arteriosum, it supplies the left recurrent laryngeal nerve, which passes on the posterior aspect of the ligamentum arteriosum and then curves upwards on the posterior aspect of the arch of the aorta to find itself in the groove between the trachea and esophagus and ascends upwards into the larynx. So this nerve, as it curves around the arch of the aorta, it might be compressed here between the aorta, between an aneurysm in the arch of the aorta and the pulmonary trunk and pulmonary artery. So this um, nerve is most likely to be compressed here by the aortic aneurysm. Anyhow, let's see the other option, left greater splanchnic nerve. Greater splanchnic nerve is a branch of the sympathetic trunk, and as we have mentioned, that the sympathetic trunk is away from the arch of the aorta and the greater splanchnic nerve, lesser splanchnic, least splanchnic, all these branches of the sympathetic trunk, they are away from the arch of the aorta and are less likely to be compressed. So the nerve that is most likely to be compressed in cases of aneurysm of the aortic arch will be the left recurrent laryngeal nerve.